Hey, so welcome back to our coaching and mentoring and uh, this is coach RJ once again uh, presently our uh, shipboard activities is cargo hold cleaning we just completed the discharging last port in Sri Lanka and we are now in progress of our cargo hold washing okay now what is your role as a uh, senior officer or chief officer in the management of cargo hold washing especially when it comes to the bilges eductor system okay because if our eductor system is working properly and our uh, suction bilges in every cargo hold is not stuck okay the non-return valve is uh, free from uh, cargo residues we have a good management of our reductor system so we can strip as fast as we can the water that uh, stayed in the cargo hold okay so we can uh, dry up as soon as possible okay now we already completed uh, cargo hold number one number two and we are now in progress of cargo hold number three all right so i'll show you to confirm okay we have an alarm builds alarm here this is cargo hold number three meaning the builds alarm inside the cargo hold number three builds is working properly okay because my guys my team are working there okay uh, they're car making or doing the cargo hold washings all over the cargo hold bulkheads okay and we have another team on deck to wash all over the um, hatch combing and hatch covers as well and includes the main deck as well okay to save time all right now here so this is the valves of uh, cargo holds a uh, bill just the water rings okay so now presently we use the uh, cargo hold number three starboard side okay we open and the suction is still very good and I will show you later. I will go to the cargo hold to show you how this uh, cargo hold washing uh, going on and how we do it. And you can also see the progress of the water if the watering, uh, the watering or the adductor is really work properly. All right, and this makes us more uh, easier. Uh, because we can finish the cargo hold washing as fast as possible. Okay, we have very short uh, loading port from Sri Lanka to Mormogao, India. So it takes only two days. Tomorrow night, we will be able to arrive there. So we only have one day washing, but the last night, the half of the day, we carry out the sweeping and yeah, taking out the cargo residues inside the bilges and up to now i'll show you also one of my team uh, cleaning the cargo hold bilges because we had no time previous cargo hold cleaning cleaning the bilges because it was very very cold climate there in russia so we protect the car uh, pipe sounding pipe not to be frozen so we limit the opening of hatch covers just to clean up the bilges inside the cargo hold. so that's why this is the opportunity that we clean the bilges so that it will be in good order the uh, non-return valve will not be stuck with uh, cargo residues all right stand by i will go on deck i will show you how the cargo hold washing and cargo hold cleaning and also the cleaning on the main deck as well all right so this is how we practically uh, doing the shipboard operations when it comes to preparing the cargo hold for loading this is the condition of a cargo hold after the discharging okay now we 
collected cargo residue yesterday from sweeping and uh, you know, cargo from that pipe guards. Okay? See, we have two pipe guards there. Cargo were stuck there, previous cargo as well. And we had a chance to collect that uh, cargo from the pipe guards, so that's why we had these uh, drums okay, collected cargo residues. Now, this time, one of this uh, team among this uh, group, okay, we had three groups now working different uh, tasks. This team is collecting the cargo residues inside the bilges okay we have port and starboard bilges we did not able to clean this previously during our cargo cleaning because of the weather it's too cold okay we cannot open uh, our cargo hold or the hatch cover in order to protect the uh, ballast pipes uh, against frozen Okay. Back on the mix. Okay. One team is working on deck, the combing and hatch covers. And one team will allow the buckets. Okay. See, as you can see there, you cannot see the large amount of water stuck in there because the suction okay, of the dewatering system or the adductor is working This is uh, normal practice of the bulk carrier. This is cargo hold washing. Okay, just remove the dark stain from the cargo, like pool, you see, and uh, dust, especially from the corner. The, some cargo residues stuck in there in the corner pipe guards. And, and around or behind the frames okay quick washing down okay two person assessing the one who holding the hose with a good high pressure of seawater all right and we have we have also one team who is in charge of cleaning the main deck and also all over these hatch covers and hatch combing all around so uh, as long they complete this hatch covers uh, being washed also the hatch combing and the channels they include also the port and starboard main deck just like that so this is to save time filaments and we will arrive tomorrow at least the main deck and cargo holds are ready for uh, loading and it's clean okay so that's it for limits how we do the normal practice on board during uh, cargo hold cleaning okay this is coach rj thank you for watching bye